Hello everyone, welcome to Cooking K channel. Today I'm going to make a one of the world's most famous salad. It is the Caesar salad. First, let's grate a half cup of parmesan. And shave half cup of parmesan with a pillar. And put them aside. Cut up a small baguette into small cubes. Move them into a pan with one teaspoonful of mixed herb seasoning. One teaspoonful of garlic powder. Two tablespoonful of olive oil. Mix them well and toss in medium heat until golden brown and crispy. Now sprinkle a handful of grated parmesan. Toss and mix well until every piece of crotons are coated with the cheese. Now cheesy, crispy, garlicky crotons are ready. And set aside for later use. Chopped up two baby jam lettuce. Washed well and soaked in icy cold water. Now for the sauce. In a bowl, add 5 to 6 tablespoonful of mayonnaise. The reason for I use mayonnaise is because I don't want to crack raw eggs into the sauce. Add 1 teaspoonful of salt. Half teaspoonful of black pepper. One teaspoonful of Dijon mustard. One teaspoonful of dry oregano. One teaspoonful of garlic powder. One tablespoonful of maple syrup. One teaspoonful of sweet paprika. Instead of using anchovies, I will add one tablespoonful of Worcester sauce. As I'm not very keen on using anchovies. If you're okay with it, anchovies are actually 
a must for classic Caesar salad dressing. Now add one tablespoonful of lemon juice. With five to six tablespoonful of olive oil. And mix them all together. Now take 10 to 12 olives. Mince them up and add into the sauce. I will save some for garnish later. Add all the minced olives to the sauce and mix them all well together. Now drain off all the water from the lettuce. Put the lettuce into a large bowl. Add in the sauce and mix them up well. This is it, ready to dish up. Garnish with some chopped up olives. Shaved parmesan and grated parmesan. Finally, some crispy garlicky crotons on top. Look at that, how beautiful it is. I can't wait. Well, hope you like my Caesar salad recipe and give it a try. And if you like it, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already subscribed, make sure you subscribe now for more recipes. Thank you for watching.